next thing we need a receiver and this is one out of another toy car and that I've already put the connectors on uh, I'll do a close-up in a minute because I have been asked about this in the past a few times but you've got the receiver control chip there this one is an RX-2-C 906-14285 these transistors here are the H bridge controlling what's that? that says M1 on it so motor 1 and those four transistors are the H bridge for M2, motor 2 and the antenna comes out there now because I've actually run, a, run out of these connectors I recently had to cut them off of this one so I could use them on a different model so I'm going to have to re-solder those now that I've got some of these come in in my post bag series and then that should be good to go right let's see can we see that chip on there there we go RX 2C or G can't quite tell and then 906142852 and these are the four transistors for the H bridge and just there it says M1 plus and M1 minus so that's motor 1 that's upside down now because I've just turned it up the other way but that does say M2 plus and M2 minus you will notice that wire is going through the top of the board the other wire isn't going through there that's because this is an old board that I've used for many things and the circuit board, the track focus. the track has actually come loose so I've had to trace it back and solder to somewhere where the track was in good condition but that is the M2 minus why I go into there now. The M1 was okay, they're soldered through the board okay. And then I've just got to replace that one and that one with a new connector. And then that will be multi purpose, we can just transfer it between cars. Right, plugged in, so steering's working. That looks okay. So there we are, a multi-purpose hobby, uh, not hobby grade, toy grade receiver, so that we can plug in a suitable battery and suitable motors 
and just transfer that receiver from car to car.